going to do some Reiki for our um, nervous system today. So we will be working in that um, root chakra today along with the crown chakra and also the throat chakra. There we go. And also resetting the heart chakra, getting that nice and aligned. There we go. So I'm lighting this Palo Santo. I love to begin the healing with creating some balance in our auric field. Just doing a little energy cleansing here. I hope you all are having a beautiful Friday. Maybe planning a little self-care this weekend. Very good. When we work in that aura, we're removing our environmental stresses, the energies that are attached to the aura from that, um, which is also great for resetting that nervous system too. All right, so let's get started. All you have to do to receive this Reiki energy is consent, giving your body permission. Thank you, somebody. Thanks, Kelly. All right, and let's go ahead and begin. Happy Friday, Mandy. Thanks, Sarah. Happy Friday. Thanks, Christina. Good to see you today. Okay. Thanks so much. Thank you, Sarah. Thanks so much. Hi, Miss Hussey. Great to see you. Thank you. Happy Friday. Thanks so much, Shelby. I appreciate that. Thank you, Jessica Lynn. Thank you, Joanna. Happy Friday. Thanks so much. Thank you, Glida. Thanks, Sarah. Great to see you. Thank you, Patty. Thanks, Glida. I will also be on later this evening for a sleepy time Reiki. I hope to see you all. Thank you, Mrs. Puff. Thank you, Miss Susie Q. Thanks so much. Thank you, Miss Pazar. Thank you, Sarah. And if you are just joining in right now, we are doing Reiki to help reduce any overstimulation to the nervous system today. So if you're feeling heavy energy, feeling anxious, um, we're working on that nervous system. Thank you, Silver. 
I'm not going to do anything intense right now. Just really cleansing that aura, detaching that heavier energy, removing any blockages, and then we're going to move in and work on that crown chakra, working on the throat chakra along with our root chakra. Thanks, Silver. Thanks so much. Thank you, Snuffin. Thanks, Leah. Hi, Amy. Thank you. Happy Friday. Thank you, Amy. Thank you, Jason. Thank you, Silver. There we go. Really settling in that energy. Thank you, Silver. Thank you, Boris. Tonight when I do the sleepy time Reiki, I will also do anchoring. So if you've been watching the anchorings, and finding those useful, um, a nice tool for, thank you everybody for those gifts. Um, it's a nice tool for somebody that's struggling with anxiety. Um, hi Amanda. And it uh, is just something else to have in your toolbox. So I will make sure to do an anchoring tonight and sleepy time Reiki also. There we go. Happy Friday. Thank you. Thanks, Amanda. There we go. Thank you, Jason. Good Friday is always a good day to get some Reiki on the aura. Thank you, Missy. Great to see you. Um, I love it just because the stresses from the week just kind of cleansing the slate, cleaning out the aura so you can have a nice relaxing weekend. Remember to breathe. There we go. I'm going to do some cord cutting here and we're in the aura still and I'm going to begin working around the crown because we'll be moving in there shortly. There we go. Thank you, Sarah. Thank you, Missy. Thanks so much. Hi, Taylor. Good to see you. Thank you, Miss Lazar. Thank you, Kai Kai. Good to see you. There we go. Thanks, Tom.
cute area. Thank you, Kels. All right, so we are going to move into that crown chakra. So some of the things that doing this, um, resetting the nervous system can help with is people that struggle with um, addiction, maybe you're having cravings or um, just having an obsession over something, this can help with that. Um, this can help with people with some trauma. Uh, this can also help with people that are getting over like heartbreak or grief loss. Uh, anything that's traumatic to the body. Um, also people that are hypersensitive um, or uh, having ruminating thoughts. It's just really helpful um, with the energy side of it. So even though there's the emotions, the residual emotions, working with the energy part of it helps uh, burden or helps alleviate the burden of the emotion. So it makes it a little lighter, a little easier to process. So that's what we'll be working on. Also, um, this is helpful for people that have illness or chronic pain as well. Um, just because when you are able to reset that nervous system again, we're removing stress. And then when you can remove stress, your body tends to uh, have a better opportunity to heal itself. So yeah, so let's go ahead and begin. Thank you, Leela. Thanks so much, Heather. Thank you. So I would like you to just imagine, not imagine, actually tap in. Hi, Marla, good to see you. Tap into that emotion, tap into that body pain, whatever it is. Thank you, Taylor. And I want you to take a moment to really identify what it is that you would like out of this healing today. And I will be using Holy Fire Reiki during this portion of the session. There we go. So if you also have higher power, if you have source energy, please allow me to channel with you. Allowing me, I'm already lighting up because I can begin feeling it. Whenever we call upon our higher power, we're trusting. We're trusting and having faith that it's going to be okay and we're also saying it's okay please guide me through this whatever this difficult moment is it's almost like when you have a child and you're grateful when your child opens up to you and says hey like i need help i need guidance on this and they're not bottling it up holding it all in on their own trying to to you know navigate life like we love to guide our children and that's what our higher power or the universe source energy whatever it is for you for me it's a higher power but um yeah it's there we don't have to look for it we just have to seek out and when you're seeking out you're just asking it's already around you sometimes we complicate it by thinking we have to find that we have to look very hard but really all we have to do is ask for help so even if you have everything together and everything's going great then all you have to do is just share gratitude gratitude to your higher power or to the universe whatever is making everything great with you all right but if you are here for healing please identify what it is that you are wanting to heal within this nervous system reset is it 
pain? Is it emotional pain? Is it physical pain? If it's physical pain, go ahead and begin focusing in on where that physical pain is in your body. If it's emotional pain, where do you feel this emotional pain most? Is it in the heart? Is it in the head? Is there ruminating thinking? Is there um, some people with PTSD, it can be very physical, so it could be all throughout the body. Wherever you would like to identify this area, if it is throughout the whole body, please find a place in your body maybe. I would say like right in that solar plexus area if, if you're wanting, wherever it's comfortable though. And now that you have identified a place in your body where this pain lies or this stress or this heavy blockage, I would like to ask you to imagine a shape. What shape is this pain? There's no shape that's wrong. It could be a heart, it could be a circle, a square, a puddle, a spiral cylinder, whatever you want to shape it. There we go. And now I would like you to think of the texture. Is it rough? Is it greasy? Is it bubbly? Is it smooth? Whatever it is, go ahead and think of the texture of this pain. It might be ra rough and rugged. Rugged could be sharp and now let's identify the color if this pain was a color what color would it be all right so we have the place that the pain is in the body we have the shape of the pain we have a texture of the pain And we have the color of the pain. All right. Now, I would like you to just gently close your eyes if you're able to. If not, just slowly and gently put them in a gaze. I want you to imagine a beautiful white light of energy pouring in through the crown of your head from the sky. This white energy might be sparkly, glittery, or glowing. Whatever it is, just allow it to pour effortlessly from the sky into your crown chakra. You may begin to feel this as a very peaceful energy, very calm. And now while we are allowing it to pour throughout our crown area, this beautiful healing white glowing energy, you can just allow your mind to wander imagining where this energy is coming from, if you would like. There we go. And now this next breath in, imagine that area in your body as if it was a hole where you could see from the front, throughout the back, if you decided to look through it. And you could see what's on the other side of your body. And now I would like you to allow that beautiful, white, glowing, sparkly, healing energy to pour down into this area of your body. There we go. Continue letting it pour in. 
You may have begun to watch it as it's pouring through this area in your body. Maybe it's pouring down through the ground into the earth. And as it is pouring through this area that's so painful, just begin to let it wash away that pain. Maybe it has to surround it for a little bit until it begins to glow around that area. There we go, continue as it's growing around that area and glowing all of that peaceful, healthy energy. We can begin allowing it to still pour through us, removing any blockages, that healing, glowing energy, watching as it still is healing this painful area of your body. There you go. Continue allowing it to heal and I'm going to quiet down and let your mind and your body, your intuition and whatever your source of energy comes from guide you in the rest of this healing as I use Reiki. to cut a couple of cords here of any heavier attachments that are a little stronger than the rest and then watch that pure energy beaming from the sky pouring down into that painful area allow it just to wash away these harder heavier attachments feel led to, once you feel that the healing is complete, I would like you to imagine your physical form, close this area up for now. to use some amethyst along with the selenite to add to the healing and protection of this energy that you have channeled yourself throughout your body today. There we go.
with resetting our nervous system and this Reiki healing and we are going to use a vagus nerve exercise. We are going to bring our arms back, bringing them back behind your head and gently resting your head in your hands. Very good. You can use this exercise wherever. I always call it a cool reset because you look so relaxed, like there's not a care in the world. So we're going to do this together, just placing your hands behind your head. If you would like, you can even lock your, your hands in and just really rest it. And now I'm going to ask you to keep your head straight throughout this whole exercise, only moving your eyes. We are going to take a nice deep breath in and yawn and look up to the right corner of the room. And exhale, bringing your eyes back to center. Very good. Now we're going to look to the left side, take a nice deep breath in and yawn. And as you exhale, please look straight center. And now our last move is looking up, keeping your chin straight. Ready? Let's take a nice deep breath in. This time you don't have to yawn if you don't feel that. Looking up to the ceiling if you can. And now exhale, bringing it back to center. Very good. And you have now reset your nervous system. Let's just shake out any last bits of heavy energy. Very good. Good job, guys. And you can do that anytime, wherever you are. If you are feeling anxious, if you are having any symptoms of um, hypersensitivity, it's always really good to reset that if you struggle with blood pressure. Sometimes that can help a little. Always get medical um, care though too as well, but that may be just something that you add in your morning meditation. There we go. I hope that you all are having a beautiful Friday. I hope that you guys join in this evening for some sleepy time Reiki. There we go. Thank you for all of the new followers. I appreciate the follows. Hi Trevor. There we go. Hi, Patty. Thank you. Thank you. Happy Friday, Marla. So good to see you. Thank you, Missy. Great to see you. Thank you, Miss Susie Q. Hi, Samar. So beautiful to see you. Hi, Amanda. Thank you for being here. Thank you, Lexi. Thank you, Taylor. Aw, thanks, Sebastian. Aw, thank you, Amanda. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thank you, Rodeo. Thank you, Missy. Hi, Chantel. Good to see you. Hi, Jackie. You're so sweet. Oh, so awesome, little angel. Oh, no. Can everybody send green hearts to Allison? I'm glad that you're here. Oh, I'm so glad you're here some more. Thank you. Thank you, Tommy. Thank you, Chantel. Thank you, Clarity. So good to see you. Hi, Pegasus. So great to see you. Hi, Kevs. Good to see you. All right, guys. Wow. Thank you, Amanda. Thank you. Thank you, Tommy. Sorry, guys. These comments are going quickly. I try my best to keep up. Thank you, Jenny. Thank you, Karana. Thank you, Clarity. So, 
Thank you, Mandy. I'll see you this evening. Thank you, Missy. Thank you, Sarah. See you later. Let's see. Thank you, Sissa. <laughs> Thanks, Sarah. Thank you, Jennifer. Thank you. All right, guys. Thank you, Sian. I'm so glad that you're here, Sunny. All right, so I'm gonna do sleepy time Reiki this evening. I'm going to continue doing these anchorings um, just because I love them. I think that they're very helpful. Um, yeah, also guys, I've been starting to download more of my meditations too. Again, like when you guys request stuff, I really try my best. And so I've been putting a lot more of those up. They're only like four minutes long, but you'll start seeing more of those too. Oh, thank you, Chantel. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thanks, Amanda. Thank you. Thank you, Daria. Thank you, God's Gypsy. All right, guys. Well, so I'm going to hop off and there's... So my grandbaby's been coming over a lot with my daughter because she's having another one. So I've been helping her uh, carry the the baby around a little bit more so I've been spoiled with grandma time it's actually been so freaking fun <laughs> thank you clarity hi Rico oh you're so sweet thank you Amanda thank you yeah super exciting he we have this really cute video I'm gonna put it on his um he found his shadow and it was so cute. He was in the stroller and I was walking him and he had his hands like, I was like, is he trying to scare something that's not there? But he saw his shadow there. So he kept like moving his hands. It was so adorable. Um, it's at, it's going to be at 7 p.m. Arizona time tomorrow. Yeah, so all right, guys. Well, I'm going to hop off. Uh, please repeat after me these beautiful Reiki principles. Thank you, Steve. Just for today, I will not worry. Just for today, I will not anger. Just for today, I will live in gratitude. Just for today, I will work honestly. And just for today, I will be kind to all living creatures. Namaste. If you guys have not followed my friend Amanda, she's right there doing the Reiki principles, give her a follow. She's a beautiful, beautiful Reiki master and a beautiful person inside and out. Um, her energy is just infectious. The moment that you are around her, it's like you've gotten a Reiki energy hug. So yes, please join into her lives as well. Thank you, Amanda, and thank you for always being an amazing friend. Thanks. Thank you, Candy. So good to see you. All right. Oh, I love that. Take care, guys. Have a good day. I'll see you guys tonight. Love you bunches. <laughs>